こんにちは皆さん、はじめまして、マックスを卒業します。ボンジュー、コモテリブジュー、マックス。よろぶねのはせよ、マックス、みだ。はい、ブリー、ワークンバックトゥのブランドライブデュー。フォール、グローズ、フォール、チョーン、アンフォール、ミス、ジューシー、ゴールデン、バックフィル、アクロリック、ファンタシー。はい、それでは、どうぞ、どうぞ、どうぞ、どうぞ、どうぞ、どうぞ、どうぞ、どうぞ、どうぞ、どうぞ、どうぞ、どうぞ、どうぞ、どうぞ、どうぞ、どうぞ、どうぞ、どうぞ、どうぞ、どうぞ、どwas the last time she was here. So, and her nails are still pretty much intact. Other than normal wear and tear, her nails look incredible. So, today we're gonna do a backfill. So, we're gonna take off all that old acrylic and we're going to do a new glitter freeage using Festival Gold. And then I'm gonna use Milk Cappuccino acrylic, which is this really beautiful beige acrylic for the Phalange Fantasia. A lot of people have asked. I even forgot I bought this acrylic actually. They asked, Max, do you have a more beige acrylic for all of the girls that want more of a beige kind of nail phalange fantasy? And the answer is yes. Her name is Milk Cappuccino. It's a really beautiful, just a soft,、um, beige, neutral color. And that's what we're gonna be using today for the fantasy. And some of the new Diamond Holic, Diamond Holic number two and Diamond Holic number five, the silver and the champagne gold color. So I'm really excited. And happy early Mother's Day!、Yay! Mother's Day is being celebrated already as of today in a lot of parts of the world, especially Latin American countries. So, Feliz Dia las Madres para todos los que lo celebran hoy. And for example, my mom, she's like, I gotta start milking it now. So, she gets today <laughs> and she gets Sunday. But I don't know what she wants to do on Sunday because to go out eat on Sunday, can you imagine what it's gonna be like? It's nuts. Chaos. Chaos, chaos, chaos. Nuts. And then anytime you go somewhere with like, a, like it's really busy, you're gonna get really crappy service. And if you're going with a big party, You're gonna be you waiting、know. a long time. Yeah, if it's more than four people, like you're gonna、oh. wait a minute. Yes. So, you guys know that our Mother's Day sale is going on all weekend long. Our Mother's Day sale is 20% off, no promo code needed, and free shipping. Yes. On every single order domestically. If you live overseas, we do have our discounted shipping rates, which are, I think, like $20 for、uh, international shipping. Cindy's like, go make that reservation so that way you don't wait. But you probably still will probably wait a little bit for the server and everything like that, too. But that is smart, though, so that way you don't wait in the lobby. I hate that.、Um, what was this? Oh,、uh, international is $20 of flat rate shipping or. Free shipping on any overseas order over 200 USD. So, if your order is over 200 US dollars, not in your local currency, you can get free shipping. If not, it's just $20 to make you holler. But if you live in America, it's free shipping on every order and 20% off. But keep in mind that it, if you cannot combine it, so if you use a promo code, you're going to forfeit that sale and then you won't get free shipping unless your order is over 100 domestically. So, Enough of me rambling, you guys. Let us begin the snatching of these phalanges. Who's excited? And we should do a giveaway. Oh, let's yeah, let's do, do a giveaway. giveaway. I'm Give gonna give away. away. Let's do how many likes do you want, Miss Juicy?、Uh, let's see. Let's, let's make it easy and fun because it's、okay. Mother's Day.、Mm -hmm. Let's do like 15. 15,000 likes? That's it? Yeah. Wow, she's basically giving it to you guys. Yeah. So, if we get to 15,000 15, likes, we're gonna give away a two ounce milk cappuccino acrylic. So, I'm excited. That means it's gonna happen. We're practically giving it away. We're practically giving it away, like some of these girls at Bojangles. Baby Cake said you look so cute, man. Thank you, it's good lighting. And also, my swelling is coming down. <laughs> Should we show a before and after? Do you guys、or? wanna see a before and after the Phalange Fantasia? Let's. Let's show the before. This is what the nails currently look like. Six weeks grown out. And then we're just going to give you a quick little sneak peek. Peek. And that's it. That's all you get. That's all you get. So I'm going to show you how we take this to that. So we're going to go in with our Bye Bye Dem nippers and take everything off. All right. Nails and lashes by Nikki s a y Mama's Day giveaway heart. Good、Early. lighting. Good jeans by、uh, Angelic Heart. And dieting, too. <laughs> like, I honestly felt like I was in a food coma after I got back. And that's because food in Asia has a lot of、um, preservatives in it.、Mm -hmm. And MSG. And MSG is no bueno. But that supposedly is what gives the food that flavor, huh? Yeah. That's what makes it delicious, is all the bad stuff in there. So I'm taking the Goldilocks bit, you guys, and I am literally filing everything off. All right, we're, we're already at 1K. Let's get it going. Come on, you guys. Keep, keep doing it. 
We can do it. Put your back into it. Go and do it. You get to eat your... Did you get to eat your pizza yet? No. no. I have not had pizza. I actually... Um, this week I had a... Or was it last week? I can't remember. I had a... Um, a pizza from Sprouts. It was... Uh, Non-GMO, non-allergen, vegan, hypoallergenic, like everything free pizza. And so it was not good. It was frozen and I put it in the oven, but when it's a gluten-free crust, it's really dry. <laughs> I know it. And like, kind of like chalky almost a little bit. That's my life. Ugh. Uh, Angelic Heart said it hurt. I'm sorry. Nails by Nikki said it hurts to watch clipping away beautiful crystals. No, they were old. They were six-week-old mamas. It's time yeah. to get new ones. So I have not had the pizza I wanted. Maybe on Monday, because Monday everybody's here at the company. So we'll do that to celebrate Mother's Day on Monday. Uh, Seagullet. Seagullet says, hi, Max. Hi, lovely. Angelic Heart said, oh, no. Drea Lachey, hope y'all have a great rest of your night and I'll watch this later. All right, Drea. Don't party too hard, girl. We're already at 2K. 2K. Tap, tap, tap. So yeah, those pizzas are nasty, huh? They are. Trader Joe's have a, has a pretty good um, gluten-free, meatless, um, spicy pizza. But other than that, like it's so hard to find a good, healthy pizza. Uh, Angelic Heart said, it's time to get your craving fixed. But uh, probably not tonight, because I gotta, I, you know, if you if you uh, give in to temptation, the flesh is weak. Um, Sega Lit says, she is from Israel. I love you. I love you too. Let's go in and clean everything out. I don't know if it's uh, Gibia or Gibia. Max, you're watching. Are you watching uh, Eurovision? He just asked me that. I, um, I've i heard the songs and uh, I actually really like Spain's entry. It's kind of giving me like retro Kylie Minogue vibes and the song is called Zorra, which means female <laughs> fox. <laughs> Um, Nails by Nikki. Margarita pizza is so, is so, is good from Trader Joe's. You know what you need to get? Don't hmm. get the gluten free. Get the cauliflower crust. It makes That's, a big difference. It still tastes kind of like... I mean, it still tastes like garbage. I'm not going to lie. But it's better than like the, the, the crust that they use. Give me a DiGiorno... Uh... Do you know who has a good gluten free and you're gonna laugh? Um, is that um, that pizza place that's over by Nordstrom Rack? Is it Mod Pizza? Mod Pizza, uh huh. They have a good one. Um, let's see, Cindy Chris, have you tried the Costco frozen pizza with the cauliflower crust? I have not. I actually recently got a Costco membership and I have not, I've only gone once. They got all kinds of good gluten free stuff there. But I like online Costco shopping because one of the skincare items that I use, I can get it on Costco.com and it's actually not that much cheaper. It costs almost the same, but might as well get it there. But one of the Japanese brands I use that um, I love their, uh, it's a rice powder face wash mm -hmm. and that really makes your face feel so clean. Like it's rid of all that dirt build up and oil and makeup and it just makes your face feel clean like you rub your face and it sounds like a dolphin oh, you know how dolphins cool. sound like squeaky? squeaky yes i get it at, um, on costco it's seki seki it is so good and in japan they changed it so if you want the original formula you can actually buy it in america but you can't buy it in japan anymore huh. which is weird so right now we're cleaning out the cuticle area with the easy bit to get it ready for the fantasy. All right, we're already at 3K, 3.6K. We're making it easy today. It's too easy if you ask me. <laughs> it's Mother's Day. It's Mother's Day. Who is celebrating Mother's Day today? Next. What? Your mom calls me. What time do you think will be done? Um, maybe, what time is it now? Six. It's gonna be six, so I would say like 6.45ish. Uh, Bonnie Johnson, why is she taking off her nails? Because they were on for six weeks, Bonnie. So we're doing a backfill. So they're not going to be French anymore. Oh, we got to... If you... I'm if sorry. I'm not on camera. Just my... We're doing something we called go. a backfill. So stay tuned. We're going to get her ready to go to uh, Mesco. Yes. She's going to go to the beach. 
She's gonna go to D. She's gonna do a, like a tour of North America. Yes. Have you ever been to Guatemala? I have not. I've never been to Guatemala either, and it's so well. It's not close, but. I mean, it's close. Relatively speaking. Mm -hmm. Um. Uh, Gidia, Gidia, am I pronouncing your name right? I hope I'm not like butchering it. Um, in Italy, it's Sunday. Yes, in the states, it's Sunday too. But today is uh, Mexican Mother's Day and a lot of Latin... Uh, American countries. Yes. All right, we're at 4K already. Let's I think go. in some places it's like International Women's Day, isn't it? I don't know. When is International Women's Day? Does anybody know? So let's go in and clean, clean, clean. We're going in with the skinny sanding band and mandrel and etching the whole nail bed. Cheyenne, I am at the salon after hours doing my own nails finally. Glad we're doing nails together. Yes, Cheyenne. That's how we roll. I hope you're using enocouture.com products because then you'd be a real ride or die. Cindy Chris said you don't need gluten free. Max doesn't need gluten free. No. I do. I have a gluten allergy, unfortunately. And sometimes gluten uh, free product uh, item, food, can have more calories than the uh, its normal counterpart, too. Yep, it has more sugar. Um, Cindy Chris said, March 8th is Women's Day. Oh. Is that International Women's Day? Um, I don't know. Or just Women's Day here in America? Men's Day is in November, I want to say. Because I was like, how come we don't celebrate Men's Day? And apparently there is one. I think it's in November. Hmm. Cheyenne said, that's all I use, baby. Period. Yes, International Women's Day, March 8th. Oh. Thank you, Cindy Chris. Thank you. It's pronounced Jadea. 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 Where's Jadea from? Italy. Ciao tutti. So Thank my, you. my friend that was in Tokyo that I was telling you about, mm -hmm. she lives in Italy now. Oh, nice. And she was telling me, she's like, people in Italy talk a lot with their hands. She was like, it's, it's not a stereotype, but she's like, it's true. And she says that. There was this video of this little girl that she saw a tree fall on top of a car and the little girl went, Mamma mia! <laughs> and she told me that this is a like Italian symbol. And it means something. Bye bye! Bye! Does anybody know what this means? Have you seen this before? I don't know. It means turn on the pasta water. Ha! Let's remove the dust. Is that true? Let me know in the comments below. She said, ciao, uh, boy, I believe that's Ciao, right. boy. Mm -hmm. I love old Italian music because a lot of Spanish songs were covers of old Italian songs. I did not know that. And one of the biggest older Italian celebrities, Regina, not Regina, Romina Power, lives in Sedona. Huh. That is to eat spaghetti. Yes. That's what the sign is. Oh, to it's eat to eat spaghetti. spaghetti. And <laughs> she's laughing. It, look, that's Eat crazy, huh? Spaghetti. On top of spaghetti. Angelic Hart said that's good to know. It is good to know. So whenever we're in Italy. Don't be flashing around your pizza sign. You're gonna go like this. Yes. To the waiter. Give me spaghetti. But I wonder if um, spaghetti in Italy, like the sauce is sweeter or is it more savory? I don't know. Tell like Filipino spaghetti. Sp Filipino spaghetti is really sweet. Because I think they make it with like bananas or something, the sauce. You know you can make ketchup out of bananas? Really? Yes. I did not know that. We're going to clean up the fridge. Man, you're a vessel of information today. Of useless facts. <laughs> savory. She says it's savory. Mmm. Do they have Hawaiian pizza in Italy? I think their pizza is different. It's yes. Like our pizza. But I'm pretty sure they have like Pizza Hut. And I think they eat it with a fork, right? Really? I think so. Ooh, that's fancy. Do you all eat pizza with a fork? I don't think they, there's something about the pizza like they... Absolutely not. Absolutely not. No... Uh, no fork or or what was the other question? Hawaiian asked, pizza. Or Hawaiian pizza. That makes me sad. You're missing out. You it's, gotta expand. That's a their their pizza is completely different. Yes, mostly with hands. Okay. So we're gonna go in with our famous non-acid primer. 
See, we're learning stuff. New things every day. But uh, that makes I, me sad you don't have Hawaiian pizza. You're really missing out on one of the wonders of life. Who would have thunk? I think Hawaiian pizza actually was like invented by like a Canadian or something. We're going to use our sculpture nail forms. A lot of things are just randomly invented here. Like... Like people celebrate Cinco de Mayo. Oh my gosh! And like Mex you go to Mexico, you go to and, Mexico it's like and they don't a ghost celebrate town. Cinco de Mayo. Only in Puebla. Only in Puebla, because it was the battle with the little kids, right? In Puebla. Uh, let me see. Heather uh, Whitmer said Hawaiian pizza with jalapenos and honey is the best. Oh my god, so good! I had to take it easy with the jalapenos though. It would have, I would have to eat it in the day, not at night. Because if I have jalapenos at night, ooh, girl. Heartburn? A heartburn, acid reflex. You're going to think I'm a ballerina throwing up so much. Heartburn. My acid reflex is no joke. And that is from the gastric bypass surgery. That is one of the... I have really bad acid reflex. Uh, I, like, I take a Tums and instead of like calming it, it just makes me yak more. Angelic Heart said, fun fact about me, I've never had Hawaiian pizza. Don't judge me. What are you Jelly waiting for? Heart. You gotta have it. It's so good. Or stuffed crust pizza is so good too. And uh, you know what my favorite pizza is? Hmm. Is it's um, pizza with pepperoni, black olives, and pineapple. Ooh, no mushrooms? No mushrooms. I'm not a mushroom person. No. Mm -hmm. What about truffles? No. I just stick to the black olives, and sometimes I'll throw jalapenos on there too. Every, you know, a few here and there. Yeah. Well, do you like Peter Piper pizza? I used to when I could eat it. What about Little Caesars? No. Oh, so gross. I don't like pizza, Little Caesars pizza. I don't know why it's so popular. I think my favorite pizza when I could eat it was either Domino's or Pizza Hut. And you know what I used to love growing up was, um, I don't know if you remember, maybe you're too young for this, but Round Table Pizza. Yes. Yeah. And the, the all the stuff for Round Table was like um, old English looking, huh? Yes. Like it was old like, England. Uh, yes. Like uh, Excalibur and Knights of the Round Table and that kind of stuff. Let's see. Cindy Chris, my son likes pepperoni with pineapple pizza as well. So good. And then Angelic Heart is telling, I'm happy 83. Yeah, we're in the same boat. I guess she hasn't had it either. Um, Do you remember Shakey's Pizza? Oh, yes, dude. Shakey's Pizza. And then there are those potatoes. Potato oh, wedges from Shakey's are the bomb. The best. Uh, Sharuska Cora Luxury Pizza Hut Deep Dish. Um, so good. That's a lot of bread, though. Uh, is pepperoni pizza in the U.S. like with salami? Yes. It's you can like have it a, with salami. It's like a spicy salami, though. It's not like the the salami that, yeah. It's like spicy salami. Ooh, I would have like a, a pizza with like prosciutto, salami, and like jamón serrano, like a Spaniard pizza. That sounds good. Maybe Maria. some green olives on it. Oh. Ooh, green olives are good. So we're gonna use oh, go ahead. Festival Gold Glitter today. Look how beautiful that is, you guys. See, we're so excited. We're like fighting to talk. Uh, Maria Segui Spadia, OMG. I finally made it. Hello, lovely. To Thanks for joining live. us today. Welcome, Maria. We're gonna do a, we're doing a backfill glitter ombre today, mamas. Saruska Cora Luxury California Kitchen Pizza. Yeah, they got, they got a good pie. They do. It's a little fancy though, a little expensive. Um, oh my god, I miss round table. Um, used to go with my grandma. Uh, I think they still have shakies in, in California though. I might not. We went, where did we go recently that we saw round table pizza? It had to have been in, it had to have been in California. I think, yeah, I think it was in California. Uh, where we saw the round table pizza in LA. Did you, were you like, oh my God, let's stop. Yeah, well, no, I mean, I wanted to, but it's not like I can eat it. Um, ah, okay, we don't call it like that in Italy. Pepperoni means peppers. Oh. Yeah, it's like a, it's like a spicy, it's like a spicy salami in, is what they, how they refer it in, in, uh, in Italy. In Italy, uh huh. And then, and then uh, we cut it like circular, like the salami. Mm-hmm. Uh, same thing in Australia, like they don't have, uh, like when you ask for sausage, 
you know, here we have like like kind of like ground beef sausage, right? Yeah, they'll put like a weenie on there. Over there, they it's it's like a like a legit like breakfast sausage. They don't they don't put it on their pizza. They put chicken on their pizza though. Um, Is the cheese good in Australia? I don't really remember. It's been so long. Because the cheese in Asia is disgusting. It doesn't taste like anything. It's just like gruel, white like Elmer school glue. It has no flavor. Nails and lashes by Nikki. RT has the best taco pizza. What's Never? taco pizza? I don't know. Let me see. Okie dokie. Tick taco. Tick taco. -ki? I hope I pronounced that right. Uh, midnight here in the Netherlands. Hi Still from the Netherlands. Max. Lots of love, Octavina. Hi, Octavina. She actually took my class when I was in the Netherlands. I have not been back since. And if there's a place in the Netherlands I want to visit that's on my bucket list. It's called De Effling. And that was actually the theme park that Walt Disney visited to build Disneyland. Like, that was his inspiration. And it's in the Netherlands. So it's you like, gotta use those miles and go. For real. It's this really pretty, like, uh, fairy tale theme park. Maria Seguis Padilla, thank you. I'm so excited. Charusca Cora Luxury. Fun fact, in Italy, they make their pizza with salads and fruit. Is that true? I As toppings. I don't think that is. That doesn't sound uh, right. Or maybe it depends actually, on the region. Jada, uh, Jadea, right? I hope I pronounced that again. I'm so sorry. I forgot how to pronounce your name. Uh, said not very often. Um, and I think pizza is like originally from Napoli, I want to uh, say. I guess she said that her mother is from the south of Italy. Yes, if you are in Italy, you want pepperoni pizza, ask for salamino picante. Ooh. Uh, we're, uh, Nails by Nikki said she's getting hungry with all this talking. How about pizza? Uh, maybe some mushrooms, peppers, and eggplant. So, let's see. Um, Maria said she is from Florida. And I guess the pizza, it depends on the region. They're going back and forth on what that looks like. Because Italy is shaped like a boat. Mm -hmm. You know what? I'm getting hungry too. <laughs> You're like, we're talking too much about you food. You know what? I'm hungry too. I'm trying to remember what I had in Japan that was really good. Um, okie dokie, TikTok Oki. Love seeing you do acrylic again. It's like magic. Oh, thank you. I appreciate that. We're going to use milk cappuccino. We have so much acrylic here at enocouture.com, so I will be doing a lot more acrylic. Um, we had Japanese pancakes. Have you ever seen them on social media? They're really popular. They're really fluffy and thick. They almost look like little cheesecakes. Oh, wow. And they're actually made with ricotta cheese. Oh, that's cool. So they were very creamy and rich. And um, oh, they were so good. Oh, we're at 10K. We're at 10K. Only 5,000 more Five likes, more you guys. more and we're gonna we do will a giveaway. give a prize. So we're going to use milk cappuccino here at the cuticle area, angle the nail down, and then stroke it out. Maria loves the glitter. We want the glitter to bleed, in, I mean the glitter. We want the milk cappuccino to bleed into the uh, glitter so that way we can create an ombre effect to it. All right, we're at 11, we're at 11. 4,000 more likes, you guys. Making it easy, it's Mother's Day. Literally. How many of you guys already are celebrating Mother's Day today? Hands up if you're a mom. Put a hand in the... Put your hands in the air like you don't care. Speaking of, did you go to the county fair? I did not, because that's when I had my surgery. Oh. So I was all laid up. I'm telling you, I missed all the fun with all these shenanigans I've been having. Ooh, did, uh, did Vince one go? One mom, two moms, three moms. Come through, mamas. Four moms. Uh, Vince did not go. They had a lot of concerts this year. Yeah, they had a lot of good ones. Five Moms. That one Donna, that... Donna um, Aksabi. Uh, are you a mom or are you just giving us a heart? I'm assuming you're a mom. Or maybe she... Well, obviously she has a mom. Don't worry, be Don't worry, I'm happy. She's clapping twice. Double clap. Pow, pow. See those hands. So we're taking Racer Clear, which is our fast dry and clear acrylic. And we're going to restructure the free edge. Okie dokie, TikTok Okie. I really like that name. Um, I'm a mom. Esme. Yes, Esme. Yes, I am. All right. 
Happy Mama's Day. Happy Mother's Day, my lovely. Para las mamacitas. Ahua. El compa Max y la comadre Mama Juicy. <laughs> La comadre jugosa. La comadre jugosa. <laughs> carne en su jugo. The national dish of Jalisco. Carne en su jugo. And then they have their own uh, version of uh, creme brulee in Jalisco. Samantha is a mom of seven. Whoa, girl. She's OG. How old is your oldest and how young is your youngest? Yes, tell us, Samantha. I would love to know. Have you ever been to Jalisco? I, you know what, Jalisco is like my favorite region, especially mm -hmm. when I dance, right? Mm -hmm. um, and I've never been. Really? Yes. You've never been to Guadalajara? I've Guadalajara? never been to Guadalajara or Mexico City. Uh, Saruska, Cora Luxury. Who celebrates Mexican Mother's Day? We do. I do. We ain't got no choice. It's that or the chancla. Samantha says her eldest is 24 and the youngest is 10. So 14 years of her life has been having babies. I, I commend you, my love, because yes. that is dedication. That I like all the hearts to you. Because yeah. Because I only have one and he drives me nuts. Can you imagine my mom's, my mom, my dad's mom? She had 13. Yeah. Yeah. I, I don't, I don't. But two went peace out. One went peace out at 12 because it was the second to last. She was born handicapped, so she didn't live uh, a long life. And then the last one was a boy and he died, he was uh, stillborn. Aww. But I mean, can you imagine her body? Like that, the bot, her body could probably not carry that baby. No. She was too old. I was like, geez, my dad's dad couldn't leave her alone. My grand, my mom's mom had eight. My dad's mom had nine. Nine. Wow. So I have like forty, like first cousins. Oh my gosh, that is wild. So when you guys get together, it oh, is. Oh, dude, it's a, it's a like we it's ridiculous. Like we have so many so many family members. Um, baby Dino lover, she said that's a baseball team. Yes, it is. Uh, happy Mother's Day to everyone. Um, Okie dokie, TikTok Okie. The application is like butter. Our acrylic is iconic, you guys. If you've never used our acrylic, it is literally the best in the universe. Maria Seguis Padilla. Her eldest is 44 and youngest is 26. How many you got, girl? Wow. We got a heart from Tammy and Dawson. Samantha said thank you. Um, just got the number three glitter bag. Awesome. Oh, we're almost at 15. We're at 149. Um, I'm surprised nobody's asked what acrylic brush I'm using because that's one of the questions we always get. Cindy Chris, my mom's mom had 14. Wow. Seven girls, seven boys. Are they Eight. all living? Oh, we're at 15. Woo, giveaway Woo. at the end of this video. But you guys got to stay till the end to see who's going to win. Yep. Uh, yes, sure is. On my dad's side, I think there were 10 siblings. Esme, your acrylic is great. Literally the best in the industry. Often imitated, never duplicated. Still using Enel Couture all day, every day. I'm so proud. Enel Couture at it. Said Okie Doki TikTok Oki. Where are you from, Okie Doki TikTok Oki? Maria Seguis Padilla, three youngest I had at 35. Three youngest I had at 35. Triplets? Uh, pink Puff and Pretty Nails. Love the nails. Thank you. Thank you, my lovely. Cindy Crest said, No, not all living. Esme said, love it. All of these comments are out of context. So the, the love it wasn't to the not all living, Cindy Chris. I'm just reading the comments as they come in. Oh yeah, Okie Dokie said she's from the Netherlands. That's right, you're right, that's right. She's up Octovina, Octovina, that's right. You're right. You, you know did what, say that. You know what else is really famous about the Netherlands? They have the tallest people in the world. Mm. If you ever are in Europe and you see like chicks that are like 5'9", five 5'10", five and dudes that are like 6'6", six six, they're all from the Netherlands. Saruska Acora uh, Luxury, Bonoa Festa de la Mama. I'm assuming Happy Mother's Day. Uh, what is the gold acrylic 
called? It is a glitter called Festival Silver, and we applied it with Racer Clear, which is our fast drying clear acrylic. Oh, for the homegirl from Italy, do you know who Heather Parisi is? Ocrilu. Octovina. Oh, so Oki uh, de to TikTok Oki, right? TikTok. She, it's for Octovina. Oki is short for Octovina. Mm. Okay, Octovina, we got it. I remember, remember Octavina, she told me she was like part Indonesian too because the Dutch conquered Indonesia or they colonized it. Uh, these nails are going to be gorgeous. We gave a sneak peek at the beginning. Um, nails and lashes by Nikki. Um, Cindy Chris told them what it was. Get it, girl. You need to hire Cindy Chris. <laughs> Come to Tucson and work, Cindy Chris. You know all the, the, the deets. Um, Saruska Cora Luxury, she doesn't know that person. Heather Parisi? <gasps> She's too young probably she then. She said, please tell me. You don't know who Heather Parisi is? I don't. She's this old, like, well, it was in the 80s. She was, um, this showgirl in Italy and she got discovered she was American but she was vacationing in Italy and like some producer went up to her and he was like hey do you want to be famous and that's how she got started on Italian TV huh. Cindy Chris said from California to Tucson yep girl cheaper housing not better weather but cheaper housing yes yes worse weather but cheaper housing we're gonna do a nice soft square shape today a career woman square as I like to call it so you're gonna file the free edge at, sorry, at a 45 degree angle so that way it's nice and like not too square but not like rounded either. Just very like, you know, professional woman. Everybody's active on TikTok today. Compared to the IG girls, they were really quiet, huh? Yeah, IG girls were asleep today. Everybody was chilling on IG. They were like taking it easy today. Sometimes I sneak on IG when I'm at work, mm -hmm. and then and then Max will be like, "Look, there's Miss Juicy." <laughs> and they hear you at work. And I'm at work. I'm all, "Ooh, Miss Juicy's watching." <laughs> I'm all, "Shh," and then I'll be like, "Hi." The real Miss Juicy though, she confuses me because she's like posting videos about like Jesus and the Sabbath and this and that. <laughs> Praise the Lord. And then the next thing she's on. Um, She's on uh, uh, Wild and Out, uh, fighting with Jocelyn Hernandez. I'm like, girl, you need to pick a side and stay on it. Mm -hmm. Was she able to get her remote working, Round Face? What? Was my mom able to get her remote working? No. She no. soaked it in rice? Yeah, she said no. Oh, but doesn't Walmart sell Roku controls? Is that a Roku TV? Yeah, it is. No. Oh, it's an Amazon Fire TV, huh? It's uh, in, 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 in. You can buy one on eBay. Yeah, yeah, I send you one actually. Now. But she needs it now. Because she can't watch her shows. She's like, I need my TV. It's a. Uh, it's, insignia. Oh, Insignia is at Wally World, isn't it? It should, but I send you in her. Uh, but she wants it now, Mr. Round, because she doesn't want to wait. No, she, no, she's gonna, I send you one that's overnight shipping. We'll get here tomorrow between 4 and 8. What is she going to do today? Can she stream it? Can she stream it on a phone or My something? My grandma and technology do not mix. Mm. Let me tell you what she did to the Tesla. Uh oh, Mr. Mr. Rompis is gonna spill the tea. Spill she the tea. To my grandma. Spill the tea. So I was at home, it was my day off, I think. And Max called me because he was already at work. Uh -huh. And my grandma was at her house and we do not live close. No. Kind of. Well, it's not a close enough. Just down Valencia. You know how far? Anyway. Yeah, I know how far that is. Anyways, Max is like Roundface. Mr. Roundface. Your, your, your grandma needs your help. She needs Mr. Roundface, not Roundface. Emergency lights, and she doesn't know how to turn it off. And Tesla emergency lights are extra for some reason. And she couldn't find the remote. I mean, the the button for like an hour and a half, and the Tesla was gonna die, whatever. And my mom's like, "You need to do something." And I was like, "Well, press the button you pressed to turn them on. Just press that button again." Yeah. And she's like, "I didn't press anything." Mm -hmm. I was like, okay, the car did it by itself. Anyways, mm -hmm. I was asleep, by the way. I was asleep. So she comes in hooting and hollering about the lights. So I wake up, change. All scared. All mm -hmm. freaking out. Drive over there. 
get in the Tesla, literally the center console has the emergency button, and I literally press it. She probably like hit it with her elbow or something. She blames my grandpa, but I don't know. <laughs> we'll have to check the, the Tesla camera. Yeah. Ha have you guys put the party on her, on the Tesla? The light show? Yeah, the light show, uh-huh. Yeah, you did it for uh, Christmas, right? Yeah, I haven't done it recently though. We uh, we were in uh, we were in San Diego for um, this is awful, but we were in San Diego for a funeral, and so oh, for your homegirl, huh? Yes, for my for my friend's uh, husband, and uh, so this is my son's tia. Right. And so my ex husband uh, came, you know, he went to the funeral. So oh, he did. Yeah, so we were all there. And uh, and so my mother-in-law, my ex, my mother-in-law, my ex-mother-in-law, we were all there at the funeral, and so they were all. He rented a Tesla, and they're all rolling around the Tesla, right? Oh, cool, like that. And so we were outside hanging out at the house, and then for some reason they put my mother-in-law in the Tesla, and then my son and his dad pressed the remote to do the light show, oh. but the volume was all the way up on the oh, Tesla. She and almost had a heart she attack. She almost had a heart attack, and she's and of course you know she was like you know, old school Mexican lady and she's all Ay! like she was all El like carro se solo. yeah she was like she got all scared the car is possessed <laughs> she got all scared I feel, like I feel like that's my tata because he doesn't know how to open the doors yes the back doors. <laughs> and it's when the tesla goes in plaid mode yeah. that's scary because it feels like you're on a roller coaster oh man well i'll tell you what and then i'll get back to the comments my mom she borrowed my car today you gotta hear this one mr Roundface. She borrowed my car today to go to Nogales for Mexican Mother's Day, right? right? right. So she was gonna go to visit her sisters, go to the cemetery, and then go to um, like, you know, visit her family down there. And so I lend her my car, and then she comes back, and then she's, she calls me, and she's, we're getting ready to trade cars. And then she goes, I, she goes, I, yeah, I want to ask you, there's something on the door. I don't know if it was like that. And then I was like, They what? always pull that car. And I was, I was like that. Like, what are you talking about? She's like, it was like that. She's like, no sé si estaba así. She's like, I, I think you gave it to me like this. And I was like, what the hell is she talking about? So I come out of my work to see like what, what happened. The damage. She like hit something or I don't know if she, I, I think she said she hit a curb. I think she jumped the curb and hit the wheel well of the car and then the wheel well kind of like went in and is now like rubbing bent. up against my door and it's bent. Oh, no. And then she's all, it's just a little scratch and I'm like, no man, like you totally messed up the whole integrity of the car. Yeah. And she's all, it, I, it was like that. I go, it wasn't like that. It was not like that. And so I, you know, because I haven't been feeling well and I was like, you know what? I'm not going to raise my blood pressure and I'm not going to get mad and like argue right. with her. I'm not going to have a stroke. But I was legit like, you know, and I was like, you know what? Forget it. We traded cars and I came over here. Yeah, I was like, I don't think that's the... I, I, I'm going to show you my car, dude. It's all jacked up. I'm gonna, it's all jacked up. Are you taking it to the shop? Or? I'm going to have to. So I, I I, was not in the right frame of mind to like talk with her about it, but I'm going to have to take it to the shop. Yeah, because that wheel could just... Yes. And the alignment is probably all jacked up on my car now. It like, just goes right. Yes. Well, it, it was the alignment wasn't jacked up, but I'm gonna have to go get it checked. Instead up. of turning left, you have to do four rights. I'm gonna have to turn in a circle. Uh -oh. I'm gonna have to do donuts just to park in my driveway. <laughs> Stupid. Anyhow, all right, I'm going back to the comments, but yes. Ron, please, you should check to see if Best Buy or Walmart have that remote in store for that TV. I'm pretty sure they do. Okay, where did I leave off? Uh, Cindy Chris says she's coming to already, Tucson. I talked to her though. I, I calmed her down saying that today maybe she should read a book. What is my dad going to do then? <laughs> read the Watchtower. You didn't give us a copy though. I gave your mom some. What? She asked some. Well, how come you didn't give me one? I've been asking for weeks for a Watchtower. Like that's serious. Yeah, I am. I asked you for a Bible and I have it right here. I don't know. You're not serious. <laughs> You're not a true anciano. All right. We're gonna, we're gonna, let's go to the comments. This one's overnight. She needs it now. Get it right tomorrow. They have it. They for sure have it. But what is she trying to stream? You know, sometimes you can stream things like if you have like. Basic cable events. Yeah. So like if you go, like if you stream on your phone, like let's say you're gonna go to Univision, then you go to stream on your phone, and then it'll ask you who's your cable provider, 
and then you put like if it's Cox or you know DirecTV or whatever and you just put in your password and it'll let you stream. Miss Juicy, I know this. That's too much technology for her. Yeah. Well, you're going to have to do it when you get home. Or I'll just buy the remote. Or you, or you could stop at Walmart on the way home. And that, get the that's, I don't make my life harder than it already is. Or you is. know what, just go get a whole new thing. I don't want to hear, Max! Turn on, change the channel for me. You know what? Though? And she doesn't know how to turn on the, the 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 TV from the TV. Maybe you can use a universal remote. Uh, that's what I said, but it's her since it's like smart. Mm -hmm. It has to be one of those like for Netflix. Oh, I see. You know, you know what I'm talking about? Yeah, the yeah, the ones that have the the yeah. things already. All right. Well, well, I got her one of those remotes, and she was like, "Where are the where are the numbers?" I was like, "You don't need numbers anymore." Welcome to the future. She's like, "Oh, I don't like this." Uh, I don't know. Okay, let me go back to the comments. Oh, okay. <laughs> yeah, you can you can stream it on her phone. I told her I was like, just download the app, and then that's what I use on my uh, TV. Yeah. And she's like, no, that's too much. And it's free, I think, the Spanish room. It is. Okay. Um, Maria Seguis Padilla, beautiful. Thank you, lovely. You're leaving, Mr. Face. Round face? Yeah. Okay. Are you gonna go party now? No, I'm gonna go pack now. Oh, you should you should ask uh, JP if they need to print out any orders or anything like that. Uh, I don't know where that. He always disappears during this time. Mm. Like a, he's like nocturnal. Uh, Octavina laughing. There's this many. Oh, okay. So now let's buff the top. What is she laughing at? The tall people in the Netherlands? No, no, we we had a whole conversation. Okay, let's see. Let me let me go back. Let me go back. Okay, uh, laughing. LOL. Tapered Square is my favorite. Um, uh, my mine too. You can usually download remote control apps on your phone. I had one for my Roku. Oh, thank you, Heather Whitmer. Yeah, I have a Roku too, and that's what I use, but that's too much technology for my mom. Um, let's see. They're like hearting each other's comments. You did those fast, yes. It's the music, we're jamming to the music. Yes. Uh, Saruska. My phone is gonna die tonight, good night. Plug so it in, cute. mamas. Uh, Kathy Glitterfied. Hey, y'all. Hi, lovely. Thanks for joining us today. Angelic Heart is laughing at our conversation. Hola, estás comenzando. No, we're finishing. Ya vamos a terminar. Estamos terminando. That's Miss Black Rose. Now we're going to no, go. No, ya casi bit. terminas. Oh, yes. I didn't get that far in the comments. Everybody's crying and laughing at us. Max, are you going to use rhinestones today? It is a Max video. We're gonna go in and chemically seal the cuticle area with a little bit of our non-acid primer. Um, check at Target Online. You might be able to pick it up at the store. Yeah, you could do Target Online or Walmart Online. And, and that way that. I can go buy Pokemon cards. You just want an excuse. Yes, because you guys know I have a pretty bad Pokemon card. Have what you, you showed people your Pokemon card yeah. collection? Did you see my Power Ranger toy collection? I did. I saw when I came in. This is the one I, I shipped back because it didn't fit in my suitcase. That is a life-size replica of... Yeah. That one's super cool. And I like how flashy the boxes are. Yeah. Vincent would love that one. I have more in there. I'll show you right now when we when we finish. Y'all don't even know like the seriousness. The seriousness of all the Pokemon things here. Like, yes. Okay. Um. Let's see. Pink puff, pretty nails. I'm making a Spider-Man nails. Have Ooh. you ever done a Spider-Man set? Uh, no, I don't do theme sets because that is copyright infringement if I were to air it. So no, we can do Spider-Man inspired, but I won't do something exactly the same because I don't want to get sued by Disney. All right, okay. You should do a nail room tour. Um, yes and no. So it's it, a warehouse. Yes. And then we don't, you know, we don't, uh, we don't show those kinds of things for the same reason why nobody knows what's in Coca-Cola. Proprietary information. Because we got a lot of sneaky snakes that want to copy me. Sneaky snakes. Slytherins. Actually, I've done Harry Potter tests and I and always end up in Slytherin. 
Does that make me a bad person? No. That just makes me a cunning person. Just makes you a smart person. Wait, what did you put on before? Primer. Yes, that was our non-acid primer around the cuticle area. We're too busy talking about our moms and the shenanigans with the cars. And po Power Rangers and Pokemon cards. Dude, our conversation is all over the place Random. today. Random. When I was in Korea, oh my gosh, that was, the Pokemon Center had the worst customer service too. So I hate anywhere that they sell you a bag. I'm like, dude, I spent $300 on Pokemon cards and I had to buy a bag, right? So everything that I bought did not fit in the bag. Like they were trying to play Tetris, putting everything in there and like it doesn't fit. And instead of just being, you know what, here's like a plastic bag or just give me like a trash bag. They're like, no, you can put it inside your, like my, my Louis Vuitton purse. You're like, I'm not putting that in there. I did, I had no choice. <laughs> uh, Angelic Heart, I love the length of these nails. Let's bake these. These are sculpted acrylic mamas. These are famous luxury nail forms that don't move at all. You know what, they did not move. I can totally attest to that. Because they're made with a metal kind of paper, so when you put them on, you can literally feel it inside. Yeah, them. it feels, it's not like, it doesn't feel papery or wonky, like it, it, and it doesn't even feel like cardboard. It feels really sturdy. Because it's made out of metal. Um, Dobby Potter 73, I'm a Slytherin to, and it's not a bad thing. Oh, good, 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 good. It was all worth it. Uh, I don't know, I think that makes you smart. I don't know. Cunning. Yeah. Witted. I've never taken the test. No? No. We're gonna use our new diamond holics. We're gonna use number five, which is the champagne color, and number two, which is the silver. And champagne. La champagne. Do you like champagne, Miss Juicy? Oh, I love me some champagne. I Delicious. love me some mimosas. I love me some mimosas at breakfast. I am Lunch a mimosa and dinner. person. She's a mimosa girl. Do you remember on, um, I think it was Sesame Street, there was a song called Cereal Girl. I swear that song lives in my head rent free. <laughs> Does anybody well, remember that song? I said I taste it, I gave it a whirl, and now I am a cereal girl. Oh, cereal. like material girl, but it's cereal. Oh, now that I think about it, you're right. Yes. My mind just exploded. Because that's what they do in Sesame Street. They take songs mm -hmm. and then they redo them that way. My mind just went Poof. See, now that's why you liked it. Because it was Madonna. Yeah, because you're, now you're a cereal. Cereal boy. Yep. I actually really like that song, Material Girl. Some boys See, that's kiss why you liked me. It. Some boys hug me. I think they're okay. If they can't give me proper credit, I just walk away. See, all the mamas on here like them some champagne. Nails my Nikki's like, cheers, honey. Yes, cheers. Did I tell? Did I have a you since the Madonna concert? No, no, yes. The last time I saw you had just come back from. Yeah, and I told you about my pooping story. Yes. And then we got Maria Singwis Padilla champagne. Yes, love me some champagne. Cheers, cheers. Salud. All in moderation. Yes, be responsible. I don't want any alkies. A couple of days ago, I dropped the champagne rhinestones and I wanted to cry. Oh no, Octavina. Were they mine? If they were not mine, that's okay then. <laughs> you can throw them away. Just order ours. We have now shipping $20 to the Netherlands. And since I want to go to the Efteling, I will personally go deliver them to you. I actually know that. I wonder how far it is from Amsterdam. The poor airport in Amsterdam. The airport is called Shiphole. <laughs> <laughs> it really is. Ship. S S H I P hole. Ship. Hole? Ship hole. And then, did I ever tell you the story about when it got recognized at the red uh, light district? No. Of all places to get recognized, I got well, recognized. Them ladies be needing some nails. She, and she did. She's like, I do nails as well. And I was like, really? She was like, yeah, I want to show you. I have to tell you the story off camera because it's not appropriate. <laughs> I can't wait. I'm all, let's end. Bye, y'all. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> but her name was Claudia Petrova. Yes, Max. I always use yours. Never another. Never another. I am not a cheater. Don't be a cheater, Octavina. Dutch women are faithful. Don't be a cheater. Man, we're at 20 likes. I Thank wonder, you for continuing to like. And show us love and support. I wonder if Dutch men are faithful. Are they Octavina or because of the uh, the uh, loopholes in the Netherlands, are they pretty promiscuous? 
enlighten us on relationships in the Netherlands. Because mm-hmm. I mean, when you when, when it's all over the place in the Netherlands, literally, I, do you think that they would be uh, faithful or would be like, oh, party all the time? No, no. Uh, let's see, Maria Segues Padilla, love Max. I love you more. And then yesterday I told Mr. Roundface about these. Speaking of the Netherlands, see, it's a sign from the Lord. There's these chocolates in the Netherlands, and they have a name we cannot pronounce in America because it's a bad word. But they're kisses. Uh-huh. And they, maybe Octavina can explain it to us. And then the Pete's in the Netherlands. Kisses, huh? Yes, but they, they have a bad word in front of them. So I cannot pronounce it. Yes, you saw husband still together, still strong. That's Octavina. She got herself a good one. Mm-hmm. Did our Italian uh, ladies leave? Our bambina. And then do you know all the like the the another fact about the Netherlands? I know so much about the Netherlands. Um, that's pointless. Go ahead and bake that for me. You know, um, like dance music from the 90s? Mm-hmm. Like Space Jam and all that? Mm-hmm. All that music came from the Netherlands. Like all that Euro uh, Euro techno? Yeah. That's, I did not know that. Yeah, like pump, pump the jam, pump it up, while your feet are stumped. That was all Dutch music. Vanga Boys were from the Netherlands. Oh. Yes, I bought you those, remember, fluffy like marshmallow and chocolate. She yes. She bought them for you. And so did um, the distributor I had at the time. But we can't say the name on them here. Mm. Well, that's that's a fun fact about the music. All that, they really like to party back in the Netherlands. And Nikki Tutorials is also from uh, the Netherlands. I love Nikki Tutorials. And they told me without makeup that she looks like a pig. Because her skin <gasps> is like pink. And she kind of does. Make the power of makeup for reals. I I mean I I love her tutorials. I and I didn't know she she's a she's a tea girl. I did not know that either. But now that I think about it, it's like oh she's kind of she's she does have a, a, a oh my gosh people are gonna come for me for this but no don't it's okay we'll keep we'll keep talking about the chocolates. <laughs> she's got very wide shoulders and a small little hip, L- like a football player. Maybe she plays football. I don't know. Maybe. So let's go in with liquid gummy gel and we're going to seal those edges. But I feel like she's not as popular as she used to be, huh? You know, I've noticed because I, I follow a lot and of she's, the, the... And she was one of the OGs on social media. Right. Like I follow like her. I also used to still follow uh, Candy. Um, what is her name? Um, the makeup artist Candy. What is her... Oh my goodness. Anna. Tati was another big one too. Tati was a big one. Like, uh, it's, it's almost like me? they don't like post as much anymore. Oh, I gotta do the inside. Is it Candy Johnson? Yes, I think so. Candy. Yeah, Candy Johnson. And I think the real OG was Michelle Pham. Wasn't she like the first? Oh, yes, 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 yes. Let's see the inside. Candy Love. Oh, yeah, Candy Lover is really great too. I like her. But but Candy Johnson is like the OG, like from like early 2000s is when she started. And then there was a Nigerian girl I used to like to watch a lot too, cause she would do these really funny, like these are the makeup fails of this year. And I can't remember what her name was, but she had really good videos too. Uh, in Colombia, they had marshmallow, Cindy Chris said in Colombia, they had marshmallow with chocolate like that. It was called Beso De, and then it's all doo, doo, doo. Yes, there you go. Yeah, Candy Lover 89. Let's bake that for a minute. No, you can do it normal because oh, okay. they're clear. Um, yes, but Candy Johnson was like the OG like of makeup artists like back in the day. Um, I think they changed the name recently. Uh, so it's different. It's more politically correct now. Oh, the chocolates? Yes, yeah. the chocolates. Where is Daft? Punk from I love Daft Punk. Maybe like I want to say maybe they're Dutch or Swedish or German, one of those three. I love them. Where is Daft Punk for five dollars? Let's let me look it up on my phone. I saw them at Coachella. Really? They were amazing. Yeah, a lot of those uh, makeup artists that I used to follow, like they don't really post. 
Um, like they used to. Like they oh, used they're to. French. Oh, really? Yeah. No. Since 1983 in Paris. Hmm. Guy Manuel de Jome Cristo. Gosh, he sounds like a kind of Monte Cristo. Uh, what, was, mm. what was the Spanish one? Yeah. Don Quixote de la Mancha. French. Yes. There's a store in Japan that I love and I didn't go this time. It's called Don 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 Quixote. And they literally sell everything. It's like a Japanese Walmart, but weirder. Huh, that's funny. So now after the hand comes out of the lamp, we're gonna wait 10 seconds to let the nail finish the polymerization process. And now we're gonna hit it with cotton candy cuticle oil. I think you finished this one faster. Because I know what, what to do. Uh. Because on the first one, we kind of, I'm still kind of like thinking over the, the thing. And on this hand, it's like, oh, we already have the design. But look at that, you guys. Literally a brand new set in under an hour. Exactly right. 6.45 on the dot. <laughs> Dobby Potter said it to me. How can you get weirder than our Walmart? <laughs> well, that's the people. Like, all the stuff at Walmart is pretty normal. But the people at Walmart, especially when you go to the Walmart where I live, Lord have mercy. If you ever have, like, really low self-esteem, go to the Walmart on, Car on, on Valencia and Midville, and you will feel like a million bucks. <laughs> but Don Quixote has, like, a whole bunch of really, like, random things. Like, there's a floor of, like, used Louis Vuitton bags, and then another floor of, like, adult products, and then another floor of, like, cookies. What? It is, like, the randomest place ever. Um, and then you're, like, shopping, and then all of a sudden you're, like, Don, 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 Don Quixote. In Spanish? Like, does it have a Spanish accent when they say Don Quixote? In Japanese, it's Don Quixote. Huh. But the song goes, Don, 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 Don Quixote. Huh. Um... Octavia, uh, with Christmas, I gave all my clients a cuticle oil and they were all so happy. Fabulous. Look at that little bit of bling. Cindy Chris, the glitter is so pretty. Look at that blend at that cuticle awesome. though. Lots of hearts. Good as new in that C curve. Steph B, beautiful. Look how beautiful the milk cappuccino acrylic is too, you guys. It is just a really beautiful, soft beige. So for a lot of my chocolatey kind of girls, my cinnamon kind of girls, my cashmere, my silky ganache, that want a beige acrylic without pink undertones, milk cappuccino, she's your girl right there. Silky ganache, ooh, that's pretty, huh? What skin color are you, silky ganache? I am, I'm like a, like a brownish, I'm a little morenita, as they say in Spanish. Actually, we're kind of, no, I'm cooler tone, but you're a little bit more warm. Because I'm, I'm not pale, more... but I, my skin is tan, but like I'm very blue underneath, see? And you can tell because my veins are blue. And Miss Juicy, her veins are more I'm reddish. You're a red-blooded woman. I am a lizard, so... <laughs> I'm a For reptilian. You, butter pecan. Yeah, I guess a little. Butter pecan. Yeah. How about a little roasted butter pecan? Roast to a toasted butter a pecan. A toasted butter pecan. Yeah. Ice cream. Totally. That sounds good too. Ooh, it's I can. It's a perfect color. Thank you. Oh my God, so beautiful. Thank you. So, Miss Juicy. All right. Okay, I'm gonna do the scroll. That way, people see I'm doing the scroll. To and you guys fair. know the rules. You have to live in America, and you cannot have one within the last 30 days. All right. We got pink puff and pretty nails. Where do you live, mamas? Oh, and then something really sad happened when I was in the Netherlands. Mm -hmm. So I bought this beautiful Dutch teapot beautiful Dutch ceramic. It was really expensive too. Connecticut. She lives in Awesome. Connecticut. So what I need you to do is send an email to info at enolcouture.com and make sure you include your shipping details and we're going to send you out a little two ounce milk cappuccino. So oh, let me get the nails in the camera. Let's do both hands for the final shot and then I'll tell you guys a sad story. So I bought this beautiful Dutch teapot and this like pastry plate, right? Mm -hmm. And then I asked Christina, who was my distributor, I was like, can you ship it back home to the States? Because after the Netherlands, I had to go to Sweden. Mm -hmm. And then I went to France after. And then she like literally got like a newspaper and wrapped it and threw it in a box. <gasps> so when it arrived, it was literally like shattered and I wanted oh, to die. No. It was so like they were rattling inside the package and I was like, girl, 
those neurons are not working. The math is not mathing. How do you ship Dutch ceramic without making sure it's properly wrapped? And she's like, well, they put it inside of a box. And I was like, it shouldn't rattle like a Christmas. <gasps> After that, I was like, oh, Lord have mercy. That's awful. Well, you gotta go back and get one. They were so beautiful too. They were like pink with cherries on it and Rococo. It was just beautiful. And, Congratulations, uh, pink yes. puff and pretty nails. No, you need to send an email to info at enocouture.com and let them know you're today's winner and make sure you include your shipping details and we're gonna send you out your little prize, okay, my love? And that is a wrap for today's live stream, you guys. I hope you enjoyed it. The nails came out so beautiful. Again, I wanna Thank wish you, you that Celebrate Mother's Day starting today. A happy early Mother's Day. I love you guys so much. Don't forget to take advantage of the Mother's Day sale going on. That ends Monday morning. And we will see you guys tomorrow in the next live video. Bye, everybody. Bye.